So we're going to go to our developer tab and below the toolbox and from the list arrow we are going to go and get from the ActiveX controls we're going to get the button icon here. And now we're going to go and save it or put it on our sheet right about here. Now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to double click this button and then we have our command button uh, started here. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to define some variables. Define some variables. So I'm going to go uh, dim path as string and then I'm going to go um, dim file name one as string. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get what our path is. Now, the easiest way that I know to do this is go to the actual location that you want to save this file on. So I've created a, a folder called demo on my desktop. So now I'm going to go to that, go to that uh, folder. And I'm going to click on the address bar. And there you have the path all spelled out for you. So you go control C. And then I'm going to go put quotation marks and go control V. And remember to put the uh, closing backslash on here and your closing quotation marks and your paths defined for you now. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to define what the file name is. So from our sheet, we see that Jones is located in C4. And so that's what the name I would like this file file to be named. So I'm going to go file name one equals range um, opening bracket quotations C4 quotation marks end of brackets dot text. Okay, so now we've defined that.